Team Fox for Parkinson's research. They're taking us back in time, back to the future. We were able to be outside a little bit, but we brought it in the studio. The DeLorean is still parked here at the WSBT studios. I mean, how fun to be able to bring that to life, to be able to bring the community together tonight, to be able to watch Back to the Future. But Team Fox has really seen some incredible success, raising awareness, raising funds. Steve, tell us uh, once again, just the, some of the success that you've been able to achieve through Team Fox of Michiana. Well, we started this in 2016, and uh, my wife originally became involved with Team Fox through a 5K run in Chicago. We decided that we wanted to bring it on the local level and start doing something with our local community and getting some awareness for Parkinson's disease. We started in 2016, and now in 2023, we just hit $100,000 raised for wow. Parkinson's research. We're really proud of that. And everything that we raise tonight and tomorrow is just a cherry on top. Mm, I mean, that's a that's an incredible number to be able to raise awareness, to raise funds for research, and you're inviting the community to be able to continue to raise awareness. But we're doing it in Back to the Future fashion because you both are wearing the fashions. Tom, Darla, we've got the DeLorean here. You know, why is it so fun to be able to invite the community to something? I think a lot of people have some sort of connection to the Back to the Future film. Film. So why is it fun to be able to bring the community out together? Uh, have the DeLorean there. You've got some props even with us. Look, we've got we've got the dog. We've got the hoverboard. Um, why is it so fun for you to be able to be involved? I think it's a great culmination of not only technology STEM because STEM is really important for kids nowadays. Right. Trying to understand science, technology, engineering, math. Being an engineer, just developing and putting this car together. It was a dream of mine for the past 30 years. Um, but then also, it also helps to raise a lot of awareness. The car gets a lot of attention, but we're trying to take that attention and use the vehicle mm -hmm. as a medium to help explain the problems that we're encountering and the things that we're trying to solve with Parkinson's. And so that's one of the things that we're trying to accomplish this weekend. Mm -hmm. um, I was looking for a lightning strike to get back home, but <laughs> for right now, I think I've got my Power right We've here. got you've got the banana. Got you, if everybody knows how you you power it, the compost, right? A little bit. Throw exactly. throw that in there. So we don't need the lightning strike. We have come. We have moved on in engineering, right? So we're <laughs> we might be in Back to the Future two or three, right? The fusion is there. It's much. it's yeah. there. And you mentioned that this was a dream come true. You're really using it as a vehicle to raise awareness. I love that you were able to share that. Of why that's so important to be able to take that spotlight, invite the community, but put it back on what what this event really is about. But how fun was it to really re create the I mean we're having fun this morning to be able that was still parked outside WSBT studios you've got the costumes you know why is this really just a dream come true to be able to take something you were passionate about with engineering and then use this to be able to uh, shed light on on different organizations in the community that's a really tough question to ask me so many approaches <laughs> right? to it so 1985 I met my wife we saw our first movie was back to the future I love and that so knowing that I'm like you know she likes me for a reason I don't know why but um, <laughs> She knew I was a lot of. I had a lot of fun building things and having fun with the movie, and um, so it's grown into something that uh, that really has um, put a lot of smiles on people's faces. And uh, and as a Christian, me, I feel that you know if you could just spread love. I mean, you don't have to be a Christian, but just just be a, a good believer in people, mm -hmm. and as well. Um, and so with that, the vehicle is just a great opportunity to be able to talk to people mm -hmm. and engage with people, yeah. and whether it's technical or spiritual, or in this case, a fundraising opportunity. It's like the best vehicle, <laughs> pun intended, for being able to spread positivity. It really is. I mean, this is a live shot right now of the DeLorean. I mean, people, we, you, I was up close because you could see the clocks in there. I mean, you really have tried to cr make it so accurate yeah. to the film. And Darla, you know, why is it so great to be able to invite the community out there in Middlebury happening uh, this weekend? You know, why is it great to invite the community out for something fun, but also be very mission minded as well. Yeah, well, I'm part of Middlebury then and now, and mm -hmm. it is our mission to just have fun, free family events every month. And we were approached by Steve and by Essen House to host this movie. And um, it was such a pleasure to be able to work with them and meet them and uh, help them raise money for this great cause. Um, of course, we're into everything that's going to bring families out. Uh, hopefully, it's a great evening. Um, we just love doing things in our community and making things, making it a better place. Making it a better place. So we want to invite the community because it's Definitely. happening 
tonight. Tonight. We're going back to the future tonight. I don't know if you're ready. Um, you you both are in costume. We've got the hoverboard. Steve, <laughs> are we encouraging folks to dress up in costume? Absolutely. And if you don't have one, we've got extra ones. I was going to say, ones. we're encouraging. I, I don't even <laughs> yeah. know if I wanted you to answer that question. Guys, go, even if we're not encouraging, I'm going to encourage you to show up in costume because how fun is it to be able to welcome the community in Middlebury to support a really amazing cause, but also have some fun along the way. Connect with your neighbors and connect with this mission as well. So come on out tonight night to be able to catch a back to the future. That flyer is right there on your screen. Those flashback Friday movies in the park. It's free admission. Bring your blanket, bring your chairs, bring your friends, bring your neighbors, bring everyone you know out to this movie happening tonight. Give them a call 574-320-1320 to connect with Team Fox of Michiana or easy enough, find them on Facebook.